Hey guys, I didn't get any video racing video last weekend, so I'm just gonna do a quick uh, recap here. <clears throat> I gotta get back to work. I got a big brake job I'm doing on this car, and I got a bunch of other work outside, so I'll just got a quick video in here. <clears throat> uh, I got the gears back in. I changed the gears. I had 370s in the car, and now I put back my uh, 457s, and I got the big tires back on the car. Uh, but I had a really successful weekend, and uh, those guys, they didn't see me coming because <laughs> they were not prepared. Uh, quickest car there in my class, in that street tire class, I think went a 9.14 or 9.12 or something like that. And uh, reaction times are, mine were in the 4.50 to 4.80s, and I think the best one I saw out of those guys was like a 5.80. So, I uh, pretty much just dominated, roasted them. Uh, my car went at 8.67 at 161. And... Uh, very soft off the starting line and progressing the nitrous only I was only running nitrous for like five seconds but uh, yeah those guys uh, underestimated me I think because uh, I kicked their ass but now I'm just uh, cleaning up the car getting it ready got the big tires back on took the little ones off and uh, Charging the battery, the oil change uh, should be good. Did that last time. Oh, I had to change the transmission. I was having uh, in the finals there, semi-finals, the transmission started slipping. So uh, I put that other one in that I had on the bench here. It's the same same case, same pretty much same transmission. Just uh, a little fresher than this one. So I put that in, put my gears back in. Uh, I gotta adjust the valves on this side yet. I already did the other side. And she's ready to go. So uh, we got this weekend, long weekend, three days of racing. And then next weekend is our uh, local airport drags. So I'm looking forward to that. And then after that is another street tire race. So then I got to put the gears back in and put those small tires back on. But uh, and then we want to go to the U.S. yet uh, race in Fargo this year. I'm not sure if that's going to happen. It'll probably be end of September if it does. But we want to go check that out. I want to get the car NHRA certified and I want to get my NHRA license. The track we race at right now is IHRA. So I'd like to have both. And uh, we'll see how that goes. But yeah, just a quick uh, update here. Uh, car worked very well with the small tires. Uh, the first pass, it blew the tires off, so I had to really tone it down on the launch and then uh, I got it working after about four or five runs but I had to steer the car all the way down the track this thing was like dirt tracking all the way down so it was a lot of fun but uh, I'll download this and get back to work I'll see you later one more thing I was going to mention is the next weekend when we get that airport race I got a friend of mine a YouTube buddy actually I've never met him in person a uh, really cool guy uh, I'm going to surprise you guys I, I think you most of you, my viewers probably watch his channel too. He's a bit of a party animal, and uh, you know he, he he really loves racing, and he's in, he's into cars, and you know the same kind of things that I am. Except for he's a little younger than I am, and he can probably party a little bit harder than I can because of, I mean I can't stay up past 11 anymore. But anyway, <clears throat> he's going to be here next weekend for that uh, for our local airport race so he's gonna bring his barbecue and he's gonna be doing some cooking and he's gonna be my pit man all weekend I think he's gonna be a it's gonna be a hoot so I'll have him and I'm gonna have some video on him and uh, <clears throat> and all our, our uh, racing throughout the weekend so watch for that so that'll be coming out uh, in about a I guess about a week and a half or so so uh, see you later